a few months ago we started a nano degree program on self-driving cars. We are the only institution in the world who teaches self-driving cars. I have been blown away what you guys are accomplishing. Building the original self-driving car program at Udacity was kind of crazy. We were given this, this really small team and tasked with building this instructional program that was more advanced and more cutting edge than anything really anybody had done anywhere. And when we actually opened the program up for people to enroll, um, we got thousands and thousands of people to enroll before the program even launched, many more than, than had uh, ever enrolled in a Udacity program ahead of time in the past. And it's really, um, it makes me really proud. The self-driving car industry has changed so much in the last four years. We realized that enough has changed um, that it was time to, to rebuild some portions of the nanodegree program. The new program has a lot of new material, particularly around perception and sensor fusion um, and prediction. And it has new projects using newer, um, more advanced simulators. And one of the really exciting things that's happened in the last six months is our partnership with Waymo. Students are working with real Waymo data to build projects that they can then go show to employers and other people in the industry. We have such a great team building the self-driving car program right now. We have that luxury that we, we might not have had four years ago of really picking some of the best experts from industry uh, to help teach our, uh, our courses. <laughs> The reason I want to teach a Udacity course is I really like sharing this knowledge with other people. Even through universities, it's difficult to be able to get all the classes required to go into self-driving. It's able to give them the expertise in that specific field to um, work in it later and dive more into it. You know, I dreamt about it. It's, it's like, there's nothing more uh, appealing to me than, than teaching something like this that it could actually help people to achieve their dreams, especially when it comes to state-of-the-art technology, which is what this uh, nano-degree program is, is about. Self-driving cars, they will profoundly change the definition of mobility as we know it. Autonomous vehicles will reduce accidents, they will reduce road fatalities, they will make mobility accessible to everyone, including the elderly or impaired, and they also will reduce traffic, especially in large cities. I think the biggest challenge ahead is moving from advanced driver assistance systems to real self-driving cars, where the driver is no fallback option. For human drivers, this task is simple. But remember that we have millions of years of evolution behind us, so it will take some time for machines to close this gap. When you look at the number of you know, traffic accident and deaths linked to traffic accident, um, you know, I believe that last year it was over like 39,000 people died from, from traffic accident. But in a world that, you know, where everyone has a self-driving car or like everyone is taking a self-driving car to go to work or, or commute, um, you know, that number should, should get much closer to zero, right? Self-driving cars are going to change our lives in ways I don't think we can even imagine. I think all of those things are, are just so exciting and, and offer an opportunity to change the world and, and make a real step forward into a, a different kind of life than, uh, than we have right now and, and that humanity has had before. Um, I think it's just exciting to imagine that future.